are advising all of us to take steps to stop the spread of the Omicron variant of coronavirus. Local doctors say now is the time to upgrade your face mask. CBS 4's Bianca Reyes is live with us now with a look at which types of masks to provide the most protection and where you can find them. Bianca? Well, Zach, Hoosiers have come a long way in the past two years to find a mask that best fits their needs. However, now, as a new, more transmissible variant emerges, doctors say it might be time to reconsider that choice. When you look at the spike, this latest surge, it's quite clear that that's due to Omicron. Roughly one week after the new Omicron variant was detected in Indiana, Local doctors are once again asking Hoosiers to mask up. The transmissibility is between three and four, making it twice as contagious as Delta and maybe three times as contagious as the original strain. With that in mind, we asked our experts, which masks provide you with the most protection? Uh, N95s can filter out 95% of the small particles that we're worried about. So that's where the 95 comes from. The cloth masks are somewhere in the 30 to 40% range. And so there's a big difference there. Experts at Fairbanks and Eskenazi agree. Cloth masks provide the least amount of protection, filtering about 30 to 40 percent of droplets. They say it's still better than no mask at all. Disposable surgical masks are higher on the list, but both N95s and KN95s are considered the gold standard. I would not show up to the ICU wearing a cloth mask, for example. N95 masks are the only mask Dr. Graham Carlos wears when working in Eskenazi's intensive care units. They're essential for frontline workers, but he admits they're not for everyone. So if you're going to take a flight, that'd be one where I'd probably wear one. If my wife was sick and needed chemo and I didn't want to get Omicron, I'd probably wear one even to the grocery store. Uh, so you just have to consider your own personal context and take it from there. It's a personal risk assessment that experts say everyone should be taking right now. However, they say rest assured, N95s are no longer in a shortage here in Indiana. You're not hurting hospitals or, or myself by picking those up for yourself. You're actually helping me by keeping yourself safe. Now, if you're worried about accidentally purchasing a counterfeit mask online, the CDC has provided direct links so you can buy masks from trusted manufacturers. You can find that link over on our website. That's CBS4Indy.com. Reporting in the newsroom, I'm Bianca Reyes, CBS4 News.